Hi guys and welcome to GK with JK on Thursday. Today we are looking at a footwork session. Previously we have learned the basics so now we're going to use those feet and make some more saves. For today all you need is a ball, a wall or a rebounder and a few cones. Simply make a small line of cones and in your set position move to the opposite side and then make a save and repeat. Here are some examples of how to move through the cones. So the examples you've seen are you can put two feet in between each cone, like moving across your goal, or like you just saw, you can go forwards and back. And also, if you hit a cone, don't worry, just carry on. And remember, it's key to move both ways, because you don't know which way you have to go in the game. So a different way to do this is to have two cones with a bigger gap in the middle and this tests how quickly can you get to the other side and back whilst also making a save at the end. Do you notice how when I do this I'm always in the set position ready to take a shot. Now onto the diving save, move those feet quick and dive and save. Now watch closely, how many steps do I take before I save the ball? These steps are crucial to allow me to dive further and increase my dive range. Also, look, I dive forward, this helps me also. A little tip, don't just guess where the ball is going to go, make sure you keep looking, otherwise this will happen. Here, you can see the goalie saves the ball behind the cone, meaning they dive backwards. Can you try and save the ball in front? Finally, if you have a partner, then try this. Start slightly forward from the goal and drop back into your goal quickly and set to make the save. Challenge your partner to see who can save the most. Thanks again for watching and please keep sending in your videos. Keep saving!